Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to some community chambers live on Twitch. Um, I hope everyone on YouTube is tickety boo. Um, gonna be playing through some maps tonight, no particular order, just playing through some bits and pieces. I'm gonna open up here with a couple from Determinated. The first one is going to be Anthropocene. And then we're going to head on to Carlite, and then we will go from there. I don't want to browse the workshop because that's really not what I want to do. Uh, but what I do want to do is turn on third party overlays. Hopefully, that's not going to break things. Then we can see all these nice little overlays and things. So, this is Anthropocene. Uh, this was a submission for Dark Rosen's fifth contest, and I came in third place. Congratulations. The theme was no fizzlers, but I also went a little farther and didn't use cubes or anything that would kill the player. I worked hard on this and got good advice from Tio about it. Thanks, Tio. Main elements are funnel and blue gel. The exit is always open. Hope you enjoy this first gel puzzle I made that I feel good about. The solution video is included above. No glitches, tricks, cube fire, and ninja moves required or intended. Jumping over blue gel at the end of a runway to avoid bouncing is unintended okay uh, and crouch jumping of any kind is unintended uh, if it feels wrong it probably is look at change notes to see the changes alrighty then let's jump right in and uh, see how we get on I suppose it's a bit probably be a bit rusty for a start it's been a few it's been a considerable amount of time since we last um, played some Paul 2 to be honest Oh my goodness, after playing Black Mesa, this is really sensitive. Jeez. I have to have those blurbs. Or those, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so what do we got here? We've got some a way of getting some blue gel there. Just have to excuse me for a little bit while I get myself reused to... Um, Give myself reused here to the sensitivity of Portal 2 after playing so much Black Mesa. So we do that, we can do that. We could bring that round to here. That will give us some blue gel. So maybe that's how we'll kick things off. I uh, didn't mean to do that. But I think we're as good. Because we can see that pole there. Oh my goodness. I think I'm actually going to have to turn my portal to sensitivity down. Jeez. Oh my god. Obviously I was playing with like a really low sensitivity on Black Mesa. That's all I've got to say about that. Okay, so we can plop this here. And that's firing gel bombs, which is interesting. Did I miss something? Okay, then I assume. I'm going to fling across to here, actually. I thought I'd maybe miss something there, but... Nope, that is how we are going to do that one. It's going to reverse our funnel. So... We're going to need to do this with the orange gel off there, or else we're going to lose the bounce gel. I assume these panels are just decorative. So we can drag that through there. That's behind glass though, so we can't necessarily do that. So what can we do? What can we do? We could drag that through, we could put that to there. Well, if I get some gel here. No, I forget. Again, I it's been such a long time since I played freaking Portal. Talk about forgetting mechanics. I 
And I may have just screwed myself here because I've now painted that there. I guess that grating is to stop you from getting potentially gel there. I don't know. But, alright, we've got to reset this because I've made... Mistakes were made. So, we'll do that. We'll do... That. Please. Jeez. You got an auto pool on there? And then we need to go and swap that, don't we? Back to this. Yes, I'm really stubborn. I thought I, I was was pretty adamant that you'd put a portal surface, a uh, portal magnet there. Would make sense. I'm going to save there this time, though. So we get up to here, so our options from here are, we can drag gel across here, but why would I want to drag, drag the gel? That's the big question. And I can put that there, and I could have done that before. What's going on Mika, welcome on to stream. Hope you are very well this evening. I mean, the only thing I could think would be to do... Uh, that kind of feels wrong. So I don't really know what I would do from here. So I don't think I'd be able to get enough speed now out of here, would I? Now, and you've, that's why this grating is extended here to stop you from doing that. One would assume. Yep. Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to reload that save because I don't think that's right. You have a box of Pepsi cans. Yeah, the wife came home with some, uh, some more for us today. Not that I drink a lot of uh, soda. And that was very American of me, wasn't it? Drink some soda. So I don't know what I need to do here. Oh, no I do. I totally know what I need to do here. So, I need to do this. Okay, so now I have that, I'm going to reset. But I would need to have... I need blue gel in the funnel because my idea would be... To jump up there, but I don't think I can jump there, can I? Hmm. I 
could swap it to speed gel, but I don't think speed gel would help. Plus I haven't really used the reverse funnel, so I'm clearly missing something of importance here. I oh, still not got it fixed, Mika. It's, it's a shame. The thing is, where else would I want? Hold on. Am I... Chances are I am. Am I overcomplicating this? I had blue gel there though before, didn't I? So that's the catch 22 there, isn't it? So I could. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So what if I did. Maybe that's what the reverse funnel's for. Hey, family, what's going on? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. So maybe that's what the reverse funnel is for. But I would need it to go through there. So if I did that... Oh, well, now I just screwed everything, didn't I? Or did I? My thought is, if I can get get the gel in the funnel, but then get into the funnel ahead of the gel, is that even possible? Okay, so then I need to go back, because I need to reset everything. there it's gonna be it would be quite close yeah that's that's tight timing and I don't think that's intended pretty sure that's not intended it would work gone too far. I just determined its map, Mika. Supposedly an easy one to get us going. <laughs> um, so how else can we use a reverse funnel? How else is this reverse funnel useful for us? Because the other thing is, 
there's not a there's not a great deal of gentler uh, it's more gentle isn't it I would say I don't think gentler is a word but you would say more gentle it's more gentle Oh, hold on a moment. I've just realised something. There's something I could potentially do here. This. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> okay, so I can now do this. Yeah. And this will enable me to do something like this to get some gel over here. That's a thing that we didn't have before. Don't know if it helps. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. So then we're going to go back because we're going to want to. So we'll go over here because we're going to want to then get the blue gel back. So now we can actually paint all of this because now that doesn't. Nest, that doesn't mean anything to us. We can get across to there. Also, we're going to want to do that. Okay, so now that gives us a bounce area. I think I messed up though again. I don't think I want it here. I just want it there. Because the idea is what I did before was I ran on here, bounced off there, off that panel, and then up into there. That will propel me into the funnel. So let's reset um, and we'll um, see if we can't uh, get it right this time. So let's think about what we did. We need to get rid of this first and foremost. From in here. Run across here. And uh, now we can do this. And get a little bit more. Okay, save there. Take the portal. Through here. Okay. So now we have that, we have that. We're pretty much set now, right? Because now we can run through here. Set this up over here like this. And we can jump into this portal, fire that up to there. And we should be done. There we go. That was cool. I like that. That was a clever little map determinated. Quite clever indeed. Use of paint. Excellent stuff. Uh, also, why are you using poggers when you, you know, why, why are you using that when uh, there is a knockers emote? Shame on you. Shame on you. Alright, so next up we've got your other one, which is uh, Carolite. Um, and we're out of beta, we're releasing on time. Small little chamber I whipped up in a couple of days, it's pretty simple. It's just inspired by Fumbly Bumbly's Oblique. 
This is the third test I've released in March. I am creative mood and I finally feel I found a good work pattern. Main element is a faith plate. The exit button also spawns the companion cube. No glitches, tricks, pole bumping, cope sharing, or ninja moves required or intended. If it feels wrong, it probably is. Look at the change note to see changes. It's probably a good place to uh, find it, let's be honest. Okay, so. Exit button spawns a companion cube as well. Gotcha. Gonna guess there's more than one cube. So we're gonna need to do some sort of cube swap at some point. Uh-huh. And then we're gonna want portal there, portal there. Once the cube is on that button so that we can fling back up to the top. May potentially be a way to get the companion cube, but not sure at the moment. So, uh, See if we can't get moving, shall we? How does this fizzler on the okay, case so it's only a flip panel? So we're gonna fling up to there. We have to put a portal on there. Gotcha. Uh, so we're gonna do this. Oh, we have to activate the cap hole first, though. Okay. Like so. Then put this one in here. Do we need to put that? Yeah, we do need to put that in there because we need to get that cube out. Gotcha. And once we have this cube out, um, we don't need that anymore. <laughs> Jeez. There's a lack of knockers. That's just terrible. Alright, so we can respawn this by doing that. I think, however, we're going to want to. The thing is, can we see that from there? The answer to that question is. Yes, I don't know if we're meant to see that from there. That's the other question. But. Oh, I didn't plan that. What's going on, Sonny? What is going on, Sonny OST in the house? Welcome, welcome. So, yeah, that was my concern. That was the concern. I mean, what's to stop me from doing this The only question that leaves me with is Is there a way to get the companion cube? Is there a way to get the companion cube? Let's go on, my guest. Only way you'd be able to get the companion cube. I don't think you can. I 
I don't think you can because you would need you need the the minute you drop down here there's no way to there's no way to maintain enough momentum I mean I could potentially have this portal set up here That cube wouldn't be on that button at this point. So you know what? I don't think there is a way to get the companion cube. I was wondering whether or not there'd be like enough enough to get like do this, but because the light strips, um, that stops you from doing that. So, yeah. Oh my, what's going on? How you doing? How you doing? Hope you're well. You could bunny hop the velocity from wall to wall, grabbing the cube at the same time. <sighs> yeah, I ain't that good, Sonny. How many years you've been watching me? You should know that by now. <laughs> I think we'll leave it at that. Yeah, I'm very well, thanks, uh, Mike. Very well indeed. We'll leave it as that. We solved it as intended. That's the main thing. Cool stuff, Terminator. Cool stuff indeed. All right, let's have a look through here. Let's see what we've got, which is a little bit more... So we've got a fumbly map here, look. We've not played this one. Now, let, let, it's time to butcher another name. Epiglottis? Epiglottis? Is that... Um... Seriously, Sonny. You, uh, you you seem to forget after all these years. My space bar never works. <laughs> Alright, so we've got um, Epiglottis here by Family Bumbly Easy Difficulty. Remade simple version of... Epiglottis. <laughs> I wanted to tidy up the messiness and... Ex Ex extraneous steps of the original to make it more concise. However, I also intend to release an advanced remake. Um, Epiglottis. Epiglottis. I'm, I'm so confused. They're all the same. <laughs> anyway. Epiglottitis. Which gives the second half of the puzzle for those who enjoyed the intricacy of the original. I don't know when the advanced remake will come to fruition, though. It's currently only in thought. Uh, please report any exploits and such in the comment. Your feedback is appreciated. Epiglottitis. Too many similar sounding words there, fumbly. Okay. So we got um Oh I remember I think I remember no I don't remember this. I thought I remembered this. Turns out I didn't remember this. So opening moves gotta be this. It's the only thing we are able to do. I'm guessing that button controls this flip panel, which will Let's see which way it comes up. I would assume it comes this way so we can use the light bridge portal, but it's just a uh, it's just an assumption at the moment. Right, so we have that, which is going to disable the fizzler. Can't do anything with that though until we disable that. Um, going to be a leap of faith of some description to the exit. I'm going to use that right now to head on over here. we we'll use the light bridge maybe instead of a, a leap of faith. Hey. Epic pockets. <laughs> Alright, so first things first, we will put this here. And stand on the button. So that when we... Um, drops... Should open the fizzler. From here we can go through here and 
We should be able to now bring the cube through to this side. Hmm. Oh no, we can do. We can do this. I was just thinking, well, actually, no, I can't because I need to just use two bolts to get up there, but not at all. Okay, so then to get out of here, we're going to need to go back down and use the panel here. Please go through the pole. Thank you. Okay, so then we have our uh, restricted light bridge as such. Now... Realistically... I want to be up there when that cube goes on this button so that I can pull into there and walk up to the exit, right? But... I can do this. Maybe we can do this to... Okay. So maybe we can do this to open this panel here. There we go. And we should be on the home stretch. And there we go. Cool map, Fumbly. Cool map indeed. Um... I think, as I've sort of said before, normally when you've got kind of like only a few portal surfaces, it kind of really does, um, ch it channels your thought process a lot. Look at that floor. I'm just like staring at the floor. It channels your thought process a lot, and um, there's only a certain amount of things you can do differently between um, portal shots. But um, yeah, good solid puzzle as always from yourself, Humbly. Thank you very much. Conclam, what's going on? Welcome on to the stream. Hope you are well. Um. Since you turned up, I wonder, I wonder if, does Rogan's map play now? This didn't, this didn't work last time we were streaming community maps. Nope, still doesn't work. Rogan is dead forever. <laughs> Alright, I took it back. I took it back, Mike. Completely take it back. All right, let's look for the next map. Let's play Oasis here from Asia's 16. Midnight at the Oasis. Monopole map, interesting. All right. Hey, Tio. What's going on? Welcome on to stream. Hope you're well. Me and the laser and library puzzle, a map whose little whose sorry whose title begins with the letter O, meaning a new mono portal puzzle. What is, it? is that a Sears's thing? Mono portal maps all begin with zero. I, I know I didn't know that. I started with the idea of having a life form sensor controlling the location of the mono portal when and went nuts from there. I think there's some interesting logic involved here, and hopefully all of you will find this enjoyable. Please note that cubes will activate the conductive plate even when the, on, when the light bridge is over the top of it. This is shown in the map's thumbnail. Uh, music for this is 4 from the Rex Aura Channel track. As always, feedback is appreciated. If you think you found any solutions, please let me know and I will fix them ASAP. <laughs> Alrighty then. So we have, um, that's that, that's that. Yep, 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 yep. 
So, let's think with Mono Portal. We can go down there. We can just see that shot, but I'm guessing that's going to be an unintended shot, as it's quite a narrow angle. We can go up here. And there's our life form sensor to swap things around. It's going to give us a cube. Okay. So, cube acquired. We're not going to want to hit that again in a hurry. That's disabled our Fizzler. So we could do potentially something like this and this. Gets us into this room, but not very helpful after that. If I move the cube here, so it could take that into there, but how do I return to this area if I do that? Is there a port surface I can leverage? There isn't. Ooh. Excuse me, guys. Um, We could just do this though, I mean this this That works quite well, I have to say. And then Hanky <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> What's going on Hanky? Welcome along to the stream. Thank you very much for the subscription. Much appreciated. Do I have bells going off in the background? No. I don't have bells, no. I had my uh, follow music, which is the pan pipes, but that's about it. I'm sure you didn't mean that, Sonny. Hold on. I'm being dumb. No, I'm not being dumb. Hmm. Um. No, I don't live anywhere near a church, so... So obviously there is going to be a way up to there using square. Just thinking here, can I... potentially be a way back here in the future <laughs> or maybe I'm thinking about this the wrong way round yeah okay So now I can reverse these. Yep, 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 yep. I 
Okay. I'm pretty sure that's progress because we've reversed what we'd normally be able to do with the life form sensors. So. Okay. So what comes next? Y'all gonna be rich? Woohoo! Okay, so I think what comes next is respawning the cube. I'm pointing it to there. Square is half the exit condition and them stairs over there. We'll say that at the moment, not really sure how. Not 100% sure how the, everything's working here. All right, so we're on that one at the minute. You see, the problem is now, it was like, yeah, yeah, I've done that, I've done that, excellent, 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 but I need to be able to take the cube away, don't I? Or I need to be able to make the cube respawn in some way, shape, or form. Or even better, bring the cube over to here. But that's not going to work because we've got no way of, yeah, we've got no way of getting the laser through here because it's a monopole puzzle. So the only way we can have the laser is using a portal on there, so... Yeah, for now that's not what we need to do. Let's head over here for now, and we will let's grab a quick save. So if I change this, that will still remain open. How would we respawn though? That's the big question. Thank you. Okay. So I could respawn the cube. Respawn the cube is not really going to do anything for me. I could take the cube back. Again, that's not really going to do anything for me either. I really need the cube. All right, family, thanks for stopping by and, and uh, hanging for a bit, though. Always good to see you. Thank you very much. A good morning. Pretty sure it's morning right now for you.
You see, I'm worried that I... I'm worried that that's a back step. Also... I've... Reset that as well. I think, I think I've gone backwards. That's not a problem. We can reset it again by going through this side, can't we? worried about that. I don't know, I feel like I've gone backwards. But I also feel like I've got to hit that from here. Where have I got to hit that from? Exploration. All right, well, that answers the question how we get across here then. We need the light bridge. Yeah, so. Alright, so now we go back through here. <laughs> well, welcome along, Hanky. Okay. Just go around and maybe I do need this over there. 
Alright, let's just let's just Uh I need a portal there though. Alright, so I've gotta go around. I've gotta do this. Right? No. Oh, okay, I'm confused. I'm all decrepit and confused. I done did royally mess things up though, because in order for this to work and get across there, I need a portal on here. I need a portal on the two auto portal surfaces. Right, so I fly back over across here. Place a portal on there. Walk across here. That doesn't allow me to go through there. Right. Um, I don't. I, I don't know, Mika. I've not. I've certainly not heard of anything like that before. Okay, so I need the. I need to bring the cube. Well, with this setup, I need the cube back over there. You still hearing the bells, Sonny? So, let's change this up a little bit and let's do this. Okay, that's a thing that kind of worked. And then I can do this, right? But way back so I don't think that really helps my cause here In doubt, let's reload. Okay. Now I can go to here. And I can walk out here. Walk through here. And that allows me to go over here and get a second cube. 
Progress. So this now is going to be needs to go on the light bridge because we can easily respawn that from over here. It's going to go there. Now this one. So we've kind of a bit of a free reign as what we want to do with this cube now. I mean, I say free reign, but we're still very limited as to what we can do and where we can put it. So I'll save there. Yo, money. What is going on? Welcome, welcome. Hope you are well. We could go over there actually. Maybe that's the better option. We've got things to try here. I may have made a mistake already though by losing that pole surface um, on the other side. We'll, we'll certainly see in a moment. surface is too low. Just imagine it was the right height. I don't think this is what we need to do. I think the only place we can really hit that laser catch from is from that actual portal surface on that side. So I think trying to do that is pretty worthless. It does allow me to walk all the way through the map though here. So I can go back and reposition this over here. Okay, so now what I'm thinking is I walk across portal there that's what I'm thinking How do I think I want through? Do I? How do I walk all the way through and, and reset that portal now, or switch the auto portals around? That's the thing uh, we didn't really contemplate there, did, did we? So that's not the answer. Unless we can do that with 
certain scenarios switched. Set that real quick. Yo, GM Gaming, what's going on, buddy? Welcome on to stream. Hope you're well. So we're back at this state here. Mm. So one thing we could do is this, actually. Maybe I moved the cube too early. So we'll walk through here. Walk back over here. And we can do that. Which brings into here. Now. Next question is, obviously, what does that do for us different? So we can respawn the standard cube now. Have I not solved it? That's probably a good uh, good question. <laughs> Have I just like totally overlooked the fact that I've solved it? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I thought I had to do something else with the um I thought I had to do something else with the laser. I was thinking that I oh man. Well, no, that was a, a very good map. That was a, a, a really good map, actually. Monoportal life form sensor. Um, I mean, normally with life form sensor maps, the the key the key concept to it is like reversing it from its original sort of state. So, when we originally came in the map, um, obviously we was on this side of it and it was blue. So normally reversing that is is the majority of life form sensor puzzles. Um, but yeah, no, some really good logic in that one, and uh, really good puzzle. I enjoyed that. Thank you very much. Let's see, as even if I had a massive, massive brain fart right at the end there, but um, yeah, no, it's all good. Alrighty then. So um, I'm going to take a quick break just to grab myself a drink. And after that, we'll return and we'll play a few more maps. So stick by and we will be right back. That was like the quickest break in history. All right. Anyway, um, I know that's a difficult map, so I'm trying to avoid uh, fleetingness. That's for sure. Um... Okay, let's play Homage. Do you have O'Boran on that list? Uh, I don't know. I haven't been on my... Um, I haven't been on my queue recently to actually add some new stuff in. So I've probably got a lot of stuff on there that... Um, needs to be um, added on to my list and stuff. What's going on, Spacekin? Hope you're well. And yeah, uh, the Klaus map, uh, Bullfrog actually um, recommended that uh, to me today. He said it was a really good map. Uh, he thought Klaus had done well. So um, yeah, he recommended that. So uh, so this one is um, homage to Tio. Um, two mind-boggling puzzles set in overgrown theme enjoy as Tio said no cube throwing quick portaling weird jumps or angled lasers through portals just pure logic if there are any bugs or feedback feel free to leave them in the comments and it's um Ser Seraline 
and Destination by T.O. Hammerwork by Skyrule, I think. Playtest by Lizard, Lizard Rockets. Um, solution video is attached. And the homage is... There are many great positive vibes on Mapmakers on Portal 2 Workshop, giving us fun and interest levels to rack our brains on. Homage is a way of showing appreciation to these creators through the recreation of some of the, my favourite levels of theirs. You think it should uh, contain Vantage instead? If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, Welcome. Welcome. And remember, and remember testing that is, is the, the future. future. And, and the future, future starts, starts with, with you. you. With me, apparently. Alrighty then. It's time to go into pure hammer admiration mode. Uh, Mike is here. Everyone's here, man. Everyone, everybody who is anybody is here tonight. I kid thee not. We had a Fumbly. Although Fumbly's now gone. We got Hanky. We got Tio. We've got Mike. We've got Innocent. Look, Innocent's just showing up. Like anybody that's anybody is here tonight. Tell you, let's not forget about Sunny. Those OG stream members. Back when we used to stream daily at the lunchtime, they're always here, hanging. Yeah, I know Fumbly's gone. I know Conklin. I know. Don't panic. Hey, Companion Cube and Turret. I'm pretty sure I, I Conklin actually. I actually remember the first time you came into one of my streams, which is weird. It's not weird, but yeah, I'm pretty sure I remember when you first came into my stream. Homage to you. Rogan's got that one covered. You don't like the hammer work here? He's too busy at the bottom. Mm. There's a lot of debris about, but I quite like that in an overgrown chamber. Okay, so what are we actually going to do here? You see, I would assume we're going to want to funnel that across, but I don't see a way to funnel it across as such. I haven't even like properly explored. I think. So I didn't even realise that this was a platform. So cube out there, do that to there. Alright, so I need to get the cube. Over here somehow. You see, that's the issue I have with that. Which doesn't particularly help my cause here, does it?
What we got here? We got Cy Denigan. Denigan. Hopefully I didn't butcher your name too much. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome along. Hope you are well. Hold on. Yeah, I'm making a big butchery of this. So, uh, let's put this here. I'm focused too much on that um, button. I don't need to focus on that button at all at the minute. I need to focus on this. Pulling this across to here. And then... So we do that and we do that, but then how do we, how does one, because can't go through there because that's, so maybe what I should have done is put the portal there, gone through and refired, potentially. So let's try that again. Doing something like this. Uh, it's too slow. Because you can do that, but that's really not intended, so I don't want to do that. It'd be much nicer if there was a way to like shoot this directly into the funnel. I can stop the funnel. second wait a second hold on uh I shouldn't have brought the cube through. Alright, reset. I think I worked it out. Finally. Okay. Take this over here. Put that there. Try not to fizzle it. That to there, that to there. We then do pull to there. Refizzle this cube. Then we can do this. That stand on here. There we go. There we go. I think that is what is intended. Now. I think I did too, Aaron. I saw that. I saw that. We'll bring the cube up here. I 
Right, so. I think. You've been lurking all this time, preparing something phenomenal. It better be good. Alright, so the only thing I can really do here is that and that. But then... I need to get that back. So that's not right. So I could stop the funnel. Okay. Stop the funnel. Recall the cube. Did I do it wrong again, though? Because now what I do with the cube, I can drop it up to the top here. But how do I get my funnel back? <laughs> I think I, I don't think that's right. Ah, okay, I got it. I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. So. What I should have done is I should have deployed the cube to the top while I have control of this fizzler. So we respawn. Wait for that to sit still. That goes through there. We go through here. And that is the exit for chamber number one. This far, future starter. That said, if you are simple minded, old, or right. irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. All right, chamber number two. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> Not this one. I remember playing this one originally. <sighs> but I don't remember the solution. <laughs> oh, boy. Also... There's a lot of death here. This is... Okay, so the catch just does that. I can then, if I remember rightly, I need to take this one over here. And I'm pretty sure... Now we go back. I want to put that like right in the middle. Even though it's on some debris. Or 
Debris. Okay. Now this is where it starts to get interesting. Bring that through to here. Now I'm pretty sure this wants to go here. <laughs> and then we can walk across here. But this is the this is the this is where I had the big issue when I played this map before because um, you do that to get across here but then you can't get back over easily. Ideally, you'd want to get across the middle and swap your portal to here to be able to walk then across to the other side. So I'm pretty sure I'm just going to save anyway. Walk across to there. Hold on. Yeah, because I need to put there. And I need to be on this grating while that is open, isn't it? So I can walk all the way across to there. This is what gives me the headache. And that completely screws us over. That's a pretty difficult question, to be fair. Yeah, there's no exit criteria for this, Sonny.
Have I got the cube back? Hold on. Does this, did this involve putting the cube on the light bridge? Maybe. Ah, crap. That's too high now, isn't it? Let's try that again. So I think what I do is I do this and stand on here instead. Then I can do this. And this. Huzzah! I solved it. Hooray! Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you we are did not them. All aperture science personnel. Two fantastic maps there from Tio. And thank thankfully, um, I didn't take half as long actually solving that uh, that time around. Oh boy. This, uh, we, we got a code red here, boys and girls. We got a code red. What could this be? What could this be? Great map. Don't time scale, don't cheat. I promise this map has lighting. The color is just set to black. So if your eyes aren't advanced enough to process dark lights, do impulse 100. Oh my goodness me. Shall we, um, oh, let's adapt, let's adapt. We're adapting, we're adapting. Oh my God, my monitors are so freaking bright. Right, let's, let's, let's turn off these two monitors. We don't need them. Okay. Dooden, 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 dooden. Wow. Things are going bump outside. I see things over there. What is this, Aaron? I don't know what this is. My rabbits are actually spazzing out. Are you actually Rogan in disguise here? What? Jeez. Right, I think I can turn my monitors back on because it's not as dark as I thought it was going to be. Plus, I can't see what you guys are seeing if I've turned my monitors off. Oh, 
Oh my god, it's knock. Woo! Horror. The horror. <laughs> oh my god. That was that, that that's frightening. Jeez. That's like best horror game 2020 right there. <laughs> oh boy. Like Dark Rosen's Maze, but better. You can actually win and prevent being caught by knock. <laughs> really? What do I win? All right, this is Double Flux. Uh, this is from Klaus. Uh, difficulty is 1.5 out of 10. No cube tossing glitches needed. Solve the above. Return path is not intended part of the solution. Uh, like I said earlier on, this was actually recommended earlier on today to by me to, uh, sorry, from Bullfrog. Um, And he said, uh, he said it was worth a play. So I'll tell you exactly what he said. He said, and I quote, if I can find him in my list. Uh, he said, here is a map by Klaus, which I think is pretty good and worth playing. So on Bullfrog's head, be it. All right, so. The uh, layout is reminiscent of something. The layout is reminiscent of a map where you have to do some flinging. Was it Conklin map? I don't know. Uh, anywho. Out my head. Yeah, the map I'm thinking of kind of like had this, had that kind of bit there in a fling, but there was a big pit here that you kind of had to do things and stuff in. So, all right. So funnel. Follow the cube to me. Let's drop down. Okay, so now we have a reversed funnel. What do we want to do with this reverse funnel? Guessing that's a return path of some description. I'm assuming you get to the exit by reversing the funnel. Hmm. Don't know, maybe that's, that's a good question. And we could bring the other cube through here. We could also bring a cube through to here. But to what avail? I'm just going to drop down here quickly. Let's 
So, I mean, we could set that to there and we could pull a cube across there. I'm guessing that's going to be the forward push, the, the blue funnel that we're going to use for the exit, I would assume. And even after playing like some of them three or four, three, four, five times through, I still forget the solutions to some of them. Like Christ. There's some corkers towards the end of the game. Some absolute corkers. Alright, what if I did this? I wonder... I did this. Okay, so we need something on here, clearly, to be able to do that. <laughs> I should hope you do know which one it is. You've seen me endure it plenty of times, Aaron. So we have that, we have that, and is it the last one in chapter four? It's the one where you discover Atlas and Peabody, and um, you have that big conversation with them, and then you decide to team up and join and create the super ultra mega aperture science force. You know which one I'm talking about. Uh. <laughs> oh jeez. Just you wait guys, just you wait until you until you play it. You're gonna love that Atlas and Peabody super super mega ultra aperture science team. You thought Portal 2 hit it on the head with co-op? We got three way. <laughs> Everyone loves a three way, right? And let's get that dirt out of our heads and carry on with the stream. Oh shit, I, for I forgot I was streaming. Shit. <laughs> uh, I'm totally sidetracked right now. I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. What am I meant to be doing? Where are we going? Um. Play co-op with Conclan. I don't think I've got any maps in my co-op queue at the minute. Conclan. Uh, Alright, I need to f buckle down here. Just need to think about what we're doing here, what we're meant to be doing. Alright, so we can't go up there. So that is purely for funneling the cubes around. So. Alright, we have that there, we have that there. Now. That's a return path. I don't particularly want to use that at the moment. I don't like the position of these stairs. It's quite difficult to get on the stairs. So, um, what we're going to do is we are going to go to the other side. 
That's what we're gonna do. We're going to the other uh, side. to somewhere. <sighs> Am I meant to drag that across there like that, do you think? Well, we did a thing. Now my issue is... How do I make use of that thing I did? Because now I don't have a reversed funnel. I can't get the cube over to there, can I? As I smack my pot filler out of the way. Do things and stuff, then you will be good. Sounds like a good idea. Oh, does that return me all the way back to there? Huh. Yeah, let, the exit's there. Okay, let me... Rewind to here. Could do that and that, but that's not really gonna help matters. Gonna check out this return path just because. Yeah, it's just gonna fizzle everything, so it's not gonna. I assume it's gonna take us over there. Um, I just feel like I need to respawn. Let's go back. I feel like I need to respawn the blue cube. Hmm. With the portal in the right place. Because of course that's, that really helps. Let's go across here. Can't do that from there, can I? Oh, hold on. So what I meant to do is... I 
I meant to do that, but stay in the funnel. So as I come across, let's just put that back to there for now. I was a little too eager. Shoot that to there. Right, but then what am I supposed to just guess where things go? I think I think swapping the cubes. Let's swap the cubes. Um Not the Rock Johnson, man. The cube's no good to us anymore. Right, so we're going to go there. Man, I used to idolise the Rock. I used to watch wrestling, man. I used to love wrestling. If you smell what the rock is cooking. He's like a massive superstar, though, a movie star, though, these days, isn't he? Let's be honest. Okay, so then we do that to there. We'll put that up there. Go back up here. Portal there. Fly across here. Respawn that cube there. down to here pull back on there cube on to here The only thing I've really seen, like, the rocking any time, like, recent was probably the Fast and Furious movies. Well, I don't know, I kind of gone off them a bit. Oh, the purveyor of Cog Johns. <laughs> if you smell what the cock is cooking just sounds completely wrong so many levels um <laughs> i gotta get this one up here right So that's where I kind of need the red cube, so have I made a mistake? I 
I don't know how else I can do anything here. I mean, I can put a portal there. I can't obviously do anything with that, but... I mean, I'm, I was thinking I could put the cube on there, stand on the button and fling that. But the only problem with that is... No, that could work. That could work. But then how do I reseat that on there? That's the only thing that might not work. So, and that wasn't quick enough. Uh, okay, well, it does work. I just need to think about what I'm going to shoot afterwards. Um, okay. Then I can do this. Now, what I should be able to do is go back over here. One, two, and use the double funnel three to go over to here. Then we can open this up here because we can see the blue funnel as well. Now I think there's something wrong with I, I, I think that's more of a monocle than a sunglasses. <laughs> Jeez. Now. Final step. I think... this cube and put it over there. So I do that. Pick up the cube. No, we cannot.
And we're done. Now, hopefully, hopefully that was, um, hopefully that was intended. This is a pretty good puzzle. There's just a few kind of like environmental things. Like I said, I think that staircase is far too close to the wall. It's really difficult to get on there. Um, but yeah, that was a good use of the on-off faith plate combined with the funnels and things. Assuming I solved that correctly. Good job. Good job indeed. Our time went. We are at quarter to midnight, so uh, I think we've probably got time for possibly one more map. One more map. Oh, I said one more map. Oh, one more map. There we go. There we go. Who needs the freaking? Who needs the original edge case? Why did I do what? <laughs> do you like my singing? We always used to sing on the frickin' Edge case is easy. Put in my leg. It's a quad map. It's been a while since so I've made some elements you haven't seen in a while. Hope you remember Exor elements. Some position, uh, position, 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 Ron. Orbs have a white surface in their bases, just a B mod bug. Uh, it's not part of the test. Weird pellet shots are also not part of the test. Everything is intended to stay nicely axis aligned. Anybody who's like been around for like absolutely donks on the stream will know that um, I used to freaking sing pretty much every single stream. I, I was always making up songs on streams back when I used to stream zombies my lunch hour and stuff. Back in like OG streaming days. I used to make up loads of songs and sing all the time and it was a happy place. And then we started playing Portal. And the rest was history. All right, so I've got to remember that blue will carry on, won't it? Yes, blue continues to go. They do, yes. So which way is this going to go, I wonder? Okay. Oh, what did that hit? Oh, it bounced off there at an angle. I've got to restart it manually. Okay. Okay. So I've got to do that each and every time. Okay. Okay. I guess that's through the first segment. I guess it's kind of a bit of a tutorial room. It's interesting that that's respawned automatically this time. We've got to retract these things back. I see what uh, court means there in the description. So we've got to retract these things back. Or is it? Or do you? Who knows? Oh, 
All right, no worries. Thanks for hanging around, buddy. Appreciate it. Have a good evening. No, maybe I don't. Maybe that's just to... Thinking about it again, I think that's probably just to, so that you don't do some like weird trick shot, angled trick shot, I guess. So... Here's my issue. How do I keep a portal over here, but at the same time Do I have to... Oh. I wonder. There wouldn't be enough time, though, to... Bit of a 50-50 though, I think, really, because I think um, I think quite a few people actually get like quite frustrated with pellet puzzles. So and yeah. They're, they're used badly as well, which, uh, so it goes there, hits there, comes back down. Can't see anything from there. So if it comes here, it's going to be halfway down. At that point, we have no way of stopping it. There's no way of doing that.
I don't know how to keep Paul on this side at the minute. Well, I had to reobtain a portal on this side at least. Because even if I like manage to find a way to get a portal there, I'm going to have a portal there and there. Which still doesn't help me. Which we've had before. I need to pull on that side. What I was thinking before is is there a way to like race the pellet? I don't doubt that it is isn't super simple, but Alright Mika, thanks for hanging buddy. Appreciate it as always. Yeah, yeah, they they kill you. Oh, maybe I don't know. I I'm not sure. That's not what I wanted to do anyway. I was trying to do the other. screws everything up.
Huh. Think about what other portal surfaces could do for me. Ultimately, I need a portal on both sides of the glass. So I need to be able to get through here. Shoot portal here. So to, to get through here, I need to send it through the life form sent the the pellet sensor, whatever you want to call it. But then I need to shoot a portal there. But then I also need to get back. I don't want to use that. That is not good. So we set this off in motion. Goes up there. To allow me through to there. From here, I can't see anything. It comes back down the sensor again, I can shoot to there. But, problem being now is that bounces off there and it goes straight to there. So how could I use other portal surfaces? Because um, the Terminator seems to allude to the fact that there's something I'm missing with portal surfaces here. Well, I can use them differently at least. control I've got more control over the pellet than I think I mean the only other thing I can think I can do the only other thing I think I can do
can't really send it over here because I can't see both of these when I'm up top here. So I mean, if it's about looping, if it's about looping the pellets, this is the best I can do. I'm not getting anything with this. Um, sure. Pellet controls the light bridges. I control the pellets. Or the pellet. The minute I kind of put this out of play, how do I stop the pellet? How can I stop the pellet from... How often can the pellet pass the sensor when you pass the bridges? Well, it's got to pass twice for me to get through there. Right? Well, the pellet can't. Sorry, the, the pellet can't cross the sensor anymore once I've crossed the light bridges. Because... Is that the right answer? It can't. Oh, hold on. The penny may have dropped.
This is the freaking life form sensor thing all over again, isn't it? What was my golden rule about the life form sensor? Half the pro half the half the puzzle is swapping Okay. I think I messed up though. Did I mess it up? I messed it up. So I go back. Oh, hold on a minute. No, 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 wait a moment. Isn't there a... I oh know the button's not there, though. So we can get the portal on there, but then how do we get out? It's not about getting out though, is it? It's about controlling the pellet. So, hold on. Let's do this. This. No. I think we gotta get the pellet to go back through the portal, right? That would seem logical. Because the problem is, I can't go back into the area where the pellet is at the moment. I 
Oh, that's clever. That's clever. That is freaking clever. You straighten it up with the angle panel. <sighs> so simple yet so clever. Jeez. Good map, Quap. Good map. Indeed. All right, guys. Well, that is going to bring us to the end of the stream tonight. Clearly without a camera. Thank you very much for tuning in. I appreciate all the support. Tomorrow night, we will either be back playing more Community Chambers or we will dive into a new Portal 2 mod. Haven't decided yet, So, um, but we will be back same time, same place, 9 p.m. BST, um, playing some more Portal 2 goodness. I appreciate that. everybody's support as always. You guys have been awesome tonight, as always. But until next time, I've been Nock, you've been awesome, see ya.